crafting. Immersive gameplay crafting. Immersive gameplay touches uh, several aspects of uh, the regular uh, crafting. Here I'm going to touch over what you can see that is, has changed in the cooking station. Okay, first of all you have ammo shipments. You can either buy ammo from different vendors uh, throughout the cities or you can make your own shipments. Shipments are usually large of 500 rounds to 1000 rounds. You simply buy them from a vendor and then you come here in order to uh, cash in on them. And you can also, but in case you have local leader and you are willing to pay 100 caps, you can make your own shipments and then you can uh, cash them in somewhere else in order to have that ammo transfer into another place. Beverages. There are no changes to beverages. Bubblegum. In the case you don't want to use the Awareness 2 perk in order to slow time based on your perception, you can craft uh, bubblegums. Uh, this will, as you can see, slow time when aiming. It lasts for 5 minutes. And it also fortifies your perception by 1 point. Uh, cloth. If you have razor grains, you can make a cloth uh, for your beds. Molotovs. There are many ways you can uh, craft molotovs uh, in case you have a uh, hard liquor, alcohol and uh, cloth or paper, you can make molotov cocktails. Oil. When you kill animals, you gather their fat and you can turn that fat into oil. Shipments. These are shipments you can sell when you have the local leader perk. You can sell shipments to vendors instead of carrying the products you uh, produce in your farm. You can take, uh, you can gather them into shipments. You can take ramen meat, uh, or rat stag meat, dead claw meat, a uh, Marler queen meat, Marler meat, uh, soft Marler meat, yao guy meat. And of course, all the vegetables and fruits you grow in your farms, you can turn them into shipments so you don't have to carry, carry them to the city, and then you can sell them in turn for whatever you wish. Okay. Did we add utility? Yes, in utility we have corn floor. Corn floor can be used to create gunpowder in the chemistry station, which you can use to create ammo. This is extremely useful for players who do not own the DLCs and the factories. Okay. Uh, certain soups will help you heal. For like the rat stack uh, stew, it will help you heal if you get sick. Okay. So that is the cooking station. I will move to the chemistry station now. Okay, immersive gameplay chemistry station. On the chemistry station you can make ammo, different varieties of ammo. I will go over each ammo type. Okay, so we first we have the rechargeable cell which of which you need the fusion cell. And with the, I'm currently running with the low tech patch, it shows a rare fusion cell, that is the name of fusion cells with the low tech patch. The rechargeable cell uh, is good for laser muskets. You can use them almost forever and then just recharge them by cranking the gun okay you have the 45 ACP as you can see the receipts uh, gun nut demolition expert you will require lead and you will require gunpowder I will go over more about gunpowder later in this demonstration so the 9 millimeter previously called previously named the 38th we have the 10 millimeter auto. We have different types of electromagnetic cartridges. We have the 12 millimeter. We have the 4 millimeter. And we also have the 8 millimeter. The 8 millimeter is now the standard uh, cartridge for the gas gun. 
with the 4 millimeter and the 12 millimeters uh, offering a different variety and abilities okay the we have the 556 this ammo which is useful for the if you have the nuka world patch the nuka world dlc and far harbor dlc as well this ammo is for um, used before was called the 308 the 762 is a more classic uh, round used in many automatic weapons okay a cyro cell as well you can create the cyro cell the shotgun shell the 50 bmg missiles plasma cottages and fusion cells ammo shipments okay you can also find the ammo shipments here as well as in the cooking station the reason for this is that i wanted it to be easier to get shipments to make it easier for players to find the shipments themselves ammo scrap you can scrap different bullets and what you get in return you get gunpowder and you get the materials used for those bullets so if you want to make uh, 50 cal bullets you can scrap a uh, 30 you can scrap 10 millimeter bullets and you can make with them 50 uh, bmg bullets okay drugs fireworks all drugs now require the chemist perk and the chemist perk doesn't extend the time you use the drugs but it is uh, crucial for creating drugs fireworks okay this is a dlc grenade gown powder okay so you have the gown powder which is the gown powder you can create with sugar bombs and fertilizer or you can create it with corn floor materials you can create different materials if you like you can make a uh, cloth from paper this simply will uh, help you create more cloth instead of uh, clicking uh, every time you have five paper and you want to turn it into cloth you will be able to turn more into cloths and you can create crystals from purified water and acid you can create fiberglass you can create gears from different from ceramics or from glass you can create a military grade circuit board which is required for some things you can create fiber optics Okay, mine same as in vanilla, uh, but some mines will require you to find the Tesla science. Pipe guns, you can create pipe guns on your own if you find the additions of guns and bullet 4. Turrets, turrets are a big thing, uh, have a lot many changes in immersive gameplay. Uh, turrets so to build turrets in immersive gameplay you need two things well, so you need targeting cards okay here you can uh, get uh, the shipments of targeting cards which you can also make on your own okay so you have targeting cards you need and you need the parts the right parts the reason for this uh, change was in order for you to be able to use both the parts you buy from vendors if you want to buy Third parts and you don't have the skills the right skills to craft them so this way you don't have to invest points in intelligence in order to craft turrets you can simply buy the parts you need from the different vendors and you can use them to fix turrets that you built before it allows for more uh, flexibility and this is why there are now third parts instead of simply using materials to build turrets so you need you have different parts here you can use if it's a missile or the advanced thirds the more basic thirds and i will also go over later about the thirds in immersive gameplay and this is when you have shipments thirds part shipments you can use here this section in order to cash in on those shipments so here in the regular thirds part you make you craft the items with the appropriate skills and in the 